Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Today I have another review for Tabanero Hot Sauce, and I'm going to be reviewing uh, another one of their new ones, and I'm really excited about this one because I've always wanted them to come out with something a little bit hotter than their uh, excellent original uh, Tabanero Hot Sauce. This stuff is really, really good. Uh, they've got a saying, flavorful and zesty. Now, if you are a, uh, or if you don't like vinegar in your hot sauces, then you definitely need to check out Tabanero uh, because it's an awesome habanero based hot sauce with um, carrots and onions and garlic and key lime juice, uh, and it does not use vinegar. It's 100% natural, so once again, if you don't like vinegar, then you definitely need to check this out. Now, uh, the one we're going to be doing today is their new one, the Tabanero extra hot and this is in the larger size um, bottle eight ounce size bottle love the shape of their bottles and another thing I'm really pleased to say not only have they listened to their customers about creating something extra spicy but you know they've completely redesigned uh, the tops of their bottles so if you've noticed here that that's completely more wide open now instead of the smaller hole and they're giving you a uh, a flow restrictor with a large hole in it that you can take on and off if you want. So that's completely redesigned. Uh, so they're really listening to their customers. So that's awesome. Now on the website, <coughs> excuse me, it says this 100% uh, all natural and gluten free Tabanero Extra Hot has the original Tabanero flavor you've come to love with an extra kick of habanero. It's about two times the heat of our original flavor. Uh, your healthy heat. Now I checked out the ingredients on this one the only difference between the original one and their new extra hot that I can see from the ingredients is that the extra hot uh, does not add um, the uh, grapefruit seed extract at the end but everything else is the same uh, the ingredients is select habanero peppers carrots onions key lime juice agave to sweeten it up a little bit garlic and salt. Sodium is only uh, 30 milligrams and uh, that is the same as on the original one. But uh, check out the consistency on this new one guys, the new Extra Hot. You can definitely tell that it's a little bit thicker than the original one. Now, I haven't opened this up, this one up, but you can see um, that this one is more fluid-like in it so it's definitely a little uh, on the thinner side than this one. They have really thickened this just a little bit. So I think the increased habanero is doing that. But let's go ahead and get into this one. Now the aroma on this is just like, uh, pretty much like the um, the original, except you're really getting a stronger um, habanero smell. You can smell the carrots. What I like about habanero is you can smell everything. It's got a nice, fresh, zesty, vegetable smell to it. Uh, you can really pick up on the carrots and the, uh, the habaneros, the carrots and the onions right off the top. Then you get a little bit of zestiness from that uh, key lime juice. But this one definitely smells richer. Um, I guess it's from the increased uh, habaneros that are in it. But let's go ahead and put it on a spoon and I just I'm not using the flow restrictor but I normally keep it on. But let's just get a nice spoonful here. Got a nice pour to this one. Definitely a little bit thicker than the original. Mm. Definitely spicier than the original. So you get an immediate up front, more of a burn uh, from the habanero peppers. That same great flavor um, that you love about habanero. Carrots, the onions, the garlic, the key lime juice. A little bit of sweetness from the agave. Now, if you really want the more sweet, uh, definitely check out the agave sweet and spicy. So this is not sweet, but very savory, very rich, uh, very, very flavor. Just like they're saying here, flavorful, uh, flavor and fire. That's what it says on this one. I just noticed that one. You know, the original flavorful and zesty and the one here is flavor and fire. Very, very good, very rich. You can definitely tell that it's loaded up a little bit more with habanero peppers. Um, let me show you what I put this on. I think this is an excellent table sauce, guys. This is what you want to use for your tacos, burritos, pizza, eggs in the morning. Just an all-around awesome table sauce. Habanero and carrots. I just love that in a hot sauce. And then with the garlic and the onions and everything, 
very, very good. So once again, if you're not a fan of the vinegar tart and sour that comes from a lot of hot sauces that are more vinegar based, you will absolutely love this. Now this is the type of hot sauce that's going to go great on pizza. There's a picture of both their new ones uh, with some pizza that we had one evening. And then I also put this on some uh, a chicken and uh, uh, noodle uh, stir fry dish, and it was really really good. So uh, on flavor, I'm going to give this one a strong 10 out of 10. I really really like it. Great job, Tabanero. Thank you so much for listening to your customers and and creating some awesome new products and redesigning the uh, the bottles. Wasn't ever a problem for me in the past, but uh, people wanted to be able to really get to it and pour it out a little bit more if they wanted to, and now they can do that, so great job on that. Um, heat, um, I'm thinking four to five category. Um, I, it's almost a five, almost a medium. Uh, it is a little bit hotter uh, to me than the original, but uh, not um, crazy, crazy hot, but it's almost, uh, you know, I'll give, it, I'll give it a low five out of 10, let me put it that way. A pretty good uh, medium habanero burn. Definitely going to be a strong medium habanero burn for the average person. But uh, great job on this one. Highly recommended products uh, from Tabanero. Check them out on Facebook. Give them a like. And the website simply is Tabanero.com. They've got a great story on there, so make sure you check it out. All right, Tabanero team, thank you so much for sending your products. I greatly appreciate it. And everybody, thanks for watching. And until the next time, you know what to do. Enjoy the burn. We'll see you guys later.